But for those of you that don't know, Jim has been the number one Cobblebacker team for 10 years running. <laughs> But I wanted to, if you would, Jim, start with when and how did you get started in real estate? That's something you know we 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 see, we hear you, we know who you are, but most of us don't know how you started. Oh well, so I got started right out of college. Actually, I was an engineer, got my degree at NC State. Uh, couldn't stand being an engineer. wasn't really good at it. You want to know the truth? And got my book, got my real estate license because I had a girlfriend who couldn't pass the real estate exam. And she told me if I would take the class with her and help her pass it, that she would pay for it. So, and I was a poor young kid and I did it. <laughs> and, and, and you know what? So I, I started out the engineering job and it was a lot of stress and I didn't really like it. And I didn't get to interlope or meet people. I didn't, I didn't like where I was sitting. So. I remember to have my license. I came back to town one weekend from working at Oakley Coke Island, which sounds great, but it was in the winter and it was cold as the devil. We were doing salt cement, so it wasn't as much fun as you think. But anyway, I came back and went and interviewed all these places, and every one of them wanted to hire me. I was like, man, I must be awesome. <laughs> jacket to see how it looked. And by the way, you can tell my complexion all over real good and gold. So it didn't work out. So when was that? That was in 1984. Wow. So you've been at this for a while. Just a little while. Seeing a few changes here and there. 